come on, guys, call me, man. People yeah. Are ready. Yeah. So for you personally, like, what is a way you could possibly see yourself returning? Well, they already set it up in the freezer scene, right? So I own yeah. some sort of pork company selling frozen pork. I don't know what kind of pork. Yeah. Um, I, he's pretty successful himself. Yeah. Um, I had an idea. First, I was talking to Ralph about my idea. I said, hey, man, have Freddie as a down and out guy, maybe homeless. He needs a job and you give him a job selling cars and he can't sell. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You feel pity for him. And then you let, that would have been cool. But yeah. they already established this thing as me being a businessman. And maybe I um, help him out or alone or, or catering you know, into the dealership. Yeah. Maybe I, I don't know, man. I don't know, but I it would be cool because we have like this thing, right? Like, I left them on the beach and I was yeah. there at the tournament, but we never had like this heart to heart, like, hey, man, I'm sorry, I was under peer pressure, yeah, like, leave your leave you out there. I should have like stuck out for you or something, you know. Yeah, I mean, you were somewhat mentioned in uh, the third movie, but other than that, we never really know what happened. So maybe, maybe they're, you know, I, hey, listen, I had like a small role, I would say, my like kind of a medium role. I, I shot a lot of it. They cut out a lot of stuff, but, yeah. but Freddie's memorable. I, I invite him to the beach. I'm the only guy that says the karate kid in the movie. Yeah. I'm the only one. Yeah. And so, um, you know, uh, they, they should have me on there, man. 